Hello everyone, welcome to the reason why I have I didn't upload any Grim Dawn episodes, uh, well one of the reasons why, I was doing some research and deciding on how I wanted to approach the Grim Dawn League, uh, thank you Crap Turtle for uh, kind of pushing me to actually go with it. Now, in this particular instance, I've mostly pre-planned my build, I, I didn't actually finalize it, I've got all the way up to like... I'd want to say up to 90, and then at that point, I'm not really sure where I want to take it. But I know what my class combination is going to be. I will be approaching this as... My goodness. I'm a really hard time with you. Uh, I'm going to be approaching this as a... Uh, demolitionist night blade combination to because this is uh, to explain if you don't know what this is um, I'm fairly new to this myself I've been aware of it since last year but I was too late to join last year so uh, I was thinking about it this year and crap turtle really uh, pushed me to uh, there we go actually go for it but I don't need this is this a better plank shield it's the same plank shield we need this though um, so this is going to be a Pierce Bleed focused um, Demolitionist uh, Nightblade, and this is mostly vanilla. It's mildly modded. Um, you can see where some of the enemies are a little higher in level. The soldier that I was having trouble with was actually level 3. He's not usually at level 4, huh? Alright, so they boosted the levels slightly here, uh, which is fine. It just means I'll have to be a little bit more careful, but this is going to be me even more serious than I typically am. Alright, so we have this. We're going to go right into this first. I'm going to grab stun jacks. Oh, there's a way I can turn on global chat, too. There's an actual global chat going on here. Um... Oh, why is my game paused? Oh, because I pressed P. Global on. All right. Oop. I'm going to have to adjust that in the settings menu. Uh, key binding. Where is pausing the game? Space, pause game, single player only. Ah, uh, we're going to have to use something very distant here. Uh, this. Toggle party display is already the map. Yes, I don't need to toggle my party display right now. Thank you. All right. Okay, now we should be able to see the global chat. Scary? Alright. Now, I'm starting this fairly late. It started at 11. This is uh, 5 o'clock in the morning. So, I'm going to be quite a decent bit behind, I suspect, but that's okay. That is fine with me. Now, like I said, I there. this is mildly modded. There are some items unique to this league. I want to take advantage of one of the sets. The set is focused around, like I said, Pierce Bleed, uh, Demolitionist, um, Nightblade. I could also have been a Necromancer, but I don't like how the skill boosts work for that half of it. So I'm going to do the Nightblade Demolitionist instead. Because uh, I just don't like how they've upgraded the good old-fashioned... Necromancer abilities there. I got a nemesis prior to level 45. Ah, okay, that's... See, this is why I turned on global chat. These uh, fascinating little tidbits. I get to uh, know ahead of time. To some extent, they spawn at level 30. Alright, so I'm going to have to watch out for nemesis at level 30 onwards. So that's good to know. Grind a lot or rep. That doesn't sound fun. Uh, it depends on how well you handle it. 
I also suppose it depends on how well your build is capable of handling something large. Although, I, like I said, the enemy levels have clearly been boosted slightly. I don't know if this is based on a percentage of my level, or if this is just going to be a flat, slight boost either way. This is going to mean better equipment and more experience for me, so I'm not too concerned about that. What happened? No longer rep-based. Ah, okay. Hold on, I'm getting killed. Never had a nemesis before. Okay, so we got some newer players if they've never had a nemesis before. Uh, which is uh, totally fine. That is... It's this is for kicks mostly. Um, I'm I'm taking it very seriously, but it's not like I'm gonna be crushed if I'm not top of the leaderboard or some nonsense. Uh, this is more like my warm up league. I've since I've never done this before, I'm kind of using this to kind of feel my way around. All right. Good. Now I'm temporarily using the one handed gun until I can get my hands on a really good two handed weapon. A two-handed ranged weapon, which is what I'll be sticking with primarily for the most part. Just all these spawn points. How do I spawn it? Yeah, they spawn all over the place depending on where you are and what you're trying to spawn. Alright. Got a decent stock of health potions right now. I'm kind of curious to see what uh, this fella is going to wind up looking like. I need physique 100. I don't have the ability for that. That's fine. Oh, holy cow, that was devastating. What in tarnation. He was not as strong as I was expecting him to be. I was My expectations for him were way higher than that. Might as well grab that for, uh, but I know you can trade potentially. I'm not really sure how that works. I, I don't care about those pants. Uh, I don't, I don't, I didn't want to pick up the pants, thank you. Get those, nope, get those out of here. Although I can't see why anyone would want to trade a Barog's Bloody Arm at such a low level, so I'll probably just sell it for spare coin. Throw those a long distance away. Yep, alright. The glory of stun jacks. I have a pretty good idea of where I want my skills to go. Like I said, my actual finalized build is I'm not 100% sure on, but I have a pretty good idea of where I'm going to take most of it. Definitely the early part. Uh, like I said, up to like level 90, I'm, I'm pretty confident of where I'm going with this. All right. What's Chad been saying? Nothing. They're just uh, grinding. That's fine. I assume that these are people probably grinding, because I, I, I know to, s I, I think at least the points are to some extent based on how much cool stuff you've collected, bosses you've killed. Things like that. There's no, like, specific time limit. It ends in December. December 17th, if I'm remembering correctly. Um. Oh, by the way, I, I earlier mentioned it was 5 in the morning. It's 5 in the morning of the 18th. Uh, just to clarify that. Uh, Alright, so we have this. I'm going to try to preserve my health potions as much as possible. Considering that these are are slightly bolstered enemies. I will be wanting to uh, shore up my health potions as much as possible. Okay. You relax. There we go. Okay. Take you out. That's fine. I wish that one came over here and hit this guy, but it did not. Oh, barely missed you. We don't have time to mess with you, so we're just going to go in and zap you to death. That's fine. This Cadence Trigger on hit effects, by the way. Yes, it does. Unless I changed it when I wasn't looking. I, I actually need a, a, a helmet. I have it on automatically. Good. And we're just going to wander on over here. Hello, fellas. Grab you up. I'm not sure how to miss that middle guy, but all right. Okay. Amen for fireballs. That 
could have been better clustered, but sure. Can I take care of you without the crystal zapping me? Yes. Good. You, I also want to... Okay, and up there it goes. Ooh. You are extremely durable. Hello. There we go. I really need a two-handed gun. Okay, Aether Crystals, good. I'll probably want those. No one spawning here? Interesting. That's kind of unusual. Get rid of you so I don't have to worry about ranged attacks. Uh, yep, you're gone. Small spread there. That was good. I wish that third one hadn't hit that zombie with the second one, but here we are. Uh, hold on. Perfect. Throw a decent spread. Alright. Gotta get rid of some of these. I should level up my... Here we go. Good. Uh, let's check and see if there's a chest back here. Usually there is. There is. Ambush chance is 9%. I don't know what that means. We're going to ask the chat. Because what is this ambush chance? Because I don't know what an ambush is. I'm assuming heroes spawn and try to kill me. I'm just assuming. I'm also assuming it's based off of the number of chests that I open up. Because that was the first actual full-on chest I've opened, and suddenly my ambush chance is 9%. Did I not type in the global chat? Since I don't... My... my text is not orange. It's if very possible. I'll have to check that in a second. That was useless. Well, okay. You know, useless is not quite the word there, but... Uh... You're currently in Global Channel 1. Yes. Trade... Global. Channel. Alright. So I want to do... Global. And then... One. There we go. All right. Take care of you. Ah, all right. We we activated you from a farther distance away than I was hoping, but sure. <laughs> All right, fair enough. However, that does remind me I will probably have to put on um I was going to put on, um, is there no, no, there's not. I was going to say, I was going to put on a, uh, a filter, but it doesn't look like that is an option, which is interesting. 
No? All right. Yes, I, I figured out that they weren't by chance, but I was kind of hoping for... Okay, that's none of that's useful. 100% guarantee. So it's basically a countdown. Now I'm going to open another chest and see if that's very specifically what it is. Because then I'll have to kind of decide whether or not the chest is going to be worth the ambush. I don't know how bad ambushes can get. Alright, this is getting a little out of hand here. We're going to activate a hull potion. We're going to run over here. We're going to... That was highly effective. Okay, yeah. So it's not like bones or anything that are dropping these. It's very specifically... It's, well, I'm sorry. Increasing the ambush chance. That's pretty good. That's definitely what I need because piercing damage is what I actually want. We are not going to bother selling that because it's not worth it. Nice. Good armor. Yeah, we need the armor. Alright, so we're doing piercing and bleed damage. So we want, I believe it's you? No. Yes. Do you bleed or do you just pierce? I can't quite remember off the top of my head. Physical and pierce. Alright, so we could we could theoretically get both of these, but we're going to very specifically start with my boy, the unknown soldier here. So we're going to go on ahead for the yellow, which is fine. We'll start with Assassin's Blade, get some yellow and purple. Um, probably get the Assassin as well. That's going to be uh, some Pierce damage there. That'll be really good. We have some Pierce resistance down here. Uh, bleeding resistance down is down here. That offers me some green and purple. Uh, I I want that, but it's going to... We'll, we'll go for the Unknown Soldier first and then see if we can incorporate that later on. It's not supremely important, but it is definitely something that I would like to have. It, it'll it depend on how we wind up with our uh, constellations here. I'll have to see how it develops. Nope, 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 nope. All right, good. Okay. Let's level up before we finish cleaning up this area. Increase that. Get out of here. That's fine. That's fine. All right. That wasn't quite what I was hoping for, but sure. There we go. Standing a bit closer than I probably should have been there, but... There we go. Alright, interesting. Oh, that's... Okay, they just... Okay, I see. I might be able to take advantage of this, actually. Considering my build so far, at least. Holy cow, these... Ghosts need to go away, though. The Yeah, it's these ones throwing the... There we go. All right, that, that was the problem, child, right there. You're less concerning, to be honest. You have slowed my attack speed. All right, take care of that, then. So this is a good opportunity for me to really take advantage. I'd rather have the current pair that I have... That's not bad, but I don't have the spirit for it. I could. That's... That's a thing. That is also a thing. Better than what I currently have. Got some better piercing here. I still don't have the stats for that. But that's fine. Whatever. We don't care right now. Alright, so we've got you. Alright, I don't know how you get points. I have zero so far. That's fine. I'm not really concerned. I'll figure it out as I go along. Um, I have this. I don't need it. Uh, I'll keep the resistances. We'll sell this. This is something I do need. Uh, mm, I'm, I don't care about my spirit right now, to be honest. And for this... Uh, I'll probably find a better two-handed weapon soon enough anyways, so we're not going to worry about it. Alright. 
I'm hoping I have the scrap I need. No, not even close. All right, that's fine. Going ahead and grab all of our delicious experience here. That's fine. All right. Greetings, child. Good. And I don't have any. Per well, I suppose I could store my. Uh, no, I'm gonna need this, and I do need this at least for now. I need to give the aether crystals to what's his name. You in here. Kasparov. That's your name. Good. Alright. We're just going to go on ahead and press on here a little bit farther. Oh, hello. That's a lot of bugs. That's a level up. That was pretty good. Pretty good. We want this. Okay. It's not like I'm really using a ton of energy, so I'm not too concerned about my uh, energy cap going down. Not at this point, anyways. You need to stop that. There we go. I, that was a little overkill, to be honest. I don't think I needed to go that far for that guy. I know better than to go in that dungeon right now. Hello? Hello? There we go. Clicking the wrong button. There we go. Don't particularly care to just fart around with you, so we're just going to get rid of you that way. I'm going to go right to my boy zombie face. Good. Oh my goodness, the poison out the wazoo. Good. That was excellent. And you knocked that off. A lot of enemies going around here, and I'm out of energy, because just the sheer amount of dudes. That's fine, though. I have energy potions. I'm not worried about it. It definitely increased uh, enemy spawn rates as well, it looks like. I whiffed that completely. Very nice. That was good. That was good. Good enough, good enough. Ah, oh, complete whiff. Alright. Good. Nice. Perfect. Excellent. Take care of you. I don't need a mace. Especially not a yellow one. So we're just going to head this way. Fantastic. Alright, get rid of you. Come on. There we go. Thank you. Just wander over this way. Get rid of these bugs. Completely whiff. What the heck? Oh, you guys slap now. Okay. Okay, I'm actually catching up to the enemies in terms of level here, which is really nice to see. I was kind of getting concerned there that this was going to be a little extreme, like some kind of massive struggle. I don't care about my ambush chance. It's a good thing. I can take advantage if I'm careful with it. Oh, there's a bug in there. Whoops. There we go. There is a totem there. That's pretty high risk, but I might try it just to see what happens. Uh, I'm guessing they'll be fairly beefy. Oh, it's stinking right here. All right, that's a whole conversation to have. Good. Get 
get rid of you really quick. All right. So I can't. There's nothing to search over here. That's fine. Let's. That's not as bad as I was expecting. All right. We'll lure you by yourself here. That's fine. Ah, uh, that. Okay, that could be mildly problematic. Who's this guy? Rogar Stone. Okay, that that definitely could be an issue. I'd like to take out the guy with the gun first. They okay. That's kind of their range there. That's fine. Get rid of you. So that's one down. And now we're looking at. Okay, so we have you two following. That's okay. You, I would like to take by yourself. I know the other guy's coming over. There he is. All right. Whiffed that. No. Can we get one of you by yourself? Can I? There we go. All right. This isn't quite how I imagined this going, but... Um... Good enough, I guess. Let's loop around here. Since you move so fast, that's fine. You're a regular guy with just a gun, so we'll take care of you really quick, and then we'll just play Ring Around the Rosie with Bozo here until he bites the dust. Okay, co collecting cool items does not necessarily get you points. I have no idea what the yellow thing I picked up was. I saw the Bone Snap Gavel, which I also don't care about. I might keep it for trading. I'm not sure. But. Alright, hold on. We need to back off here. I missed. That was bad aim. Ugh. There we go. Okay. That's a really nice pair of pants. I don't care about that either. What was this other thing? Eh, decent. Can I get up to 118? Yes. And good, good, all right, all right. That's clever. And it looks like there's still somebody, yeah, it's this guy here. Okay, good. Blood Carver. I don't have Heartseeker and I don't intend to use it. Uh, no, that's something I actually do want because I intend on doing bleeding damage. Although I don't currently, but that's that doesn't matter right now. Um, if I ever get my hands on this spirit, a uh, bolt action rifle, yes, please. I don't have the stats for it, but that's fine. Oh, wait, we can maybe artificially increase them, but we have some armor here. One twenty nine, huh? All right. That's. I guess what we'll run with for now. Let's see if that cave is up here with the rover prisoners in it. Uh, well, I guess I've got your attention first, so let's deal with you guys first, I guess. Oh, that was terrible. He absorbed all three of those. There we go. That's better. I can take care of you normally. That's fine. That worked out surprisingly better than what it initially looked like. Beautiful. Alright. Let's see if we can get you separate. Nah, you've got your friends all coming over. Alright. Good. Alright, you guys are getting a little out of hand here. That's good. I don't have any energy left. Nor do I have energy potions. Oh, wait, here we go. There we go. Alright, that's fine. I'm not worried about it right now. That issue will be resolved. Okay. That issue will not be resolved in time. I know I don't have enough energy for that. Um... This, this could get ugly very quickly. Yep. Ah, you dodged it. I mean, it hit the other guy in the background, so that's fine, I guess. Is he just summoning skeletons? Yeah, he is. And they shoot. All right.
We'll just use the tent to our advantage. Use the tree, use the tree. Your skeletons are out of control, guy. How, what is your range, by the way? What is your leashing range? Oh, that hurt. Okay. Hold up. Stop shooting me. Thank you. Okay, good. Your skeleton stuck around, though, which is very not good. Oh, hold on. I'm not... I don't have it. There we go. Oh, there we go. All right, you're just... That's fine. So eventually you all bite the dust anyways. Let's just wait this out. Because I don't want to use energy on these guys if they're just going to bite the... Yeah, there they go. Okay. I... I'll just sell this. That's... Still better than what I have, so we'll go on ahead and equip that. Uh, we'll throw this aside because we don't need that anymore. That's fine. Um, nope, we're good with that. Okay. Alright, so that, again, worked out decently well. Isn't this the crossbow that... This is the guy that drops... Uh, no, it's you that drops the crossbow. There we go. This is what I need. Requires... That much cunning. Good. Alright, we're going to throw that aside. Uh, this theoretically does more damage, but I'm looking for that pierce, so that's fine. I'm expecting... Yep, slit. Okay, that was pretty easily resolved. We have a slit necklace, which is really nice to see. Okay. That reminds me, I didn't go to the island. I probably should. I would normally be a little too late in the level to do so, but considering that this has been boosted, the levels here have been boosted slightly, I'm guessing that I'm actually not too late. We're going to go to the left, actually. Good. Okay. Now we're cooking with peanut oil. Nope. Nope. Okay, good. So that. At this point, I'm actually only going to be looking at green and higher. I don't care about my ambush chance. Ambushes are a good thing for me. Generate more gear. Go ahead and chat these guys up. That's fine. We're going to loop back around. Um, I don't need to fight the random guys on the right there. I don't want to get too high on level because that's just going to be wicked problematic. If I get too high on level and I don't want to do that, I want to keep where I'm at roughly. Because I'm still able to do a decent job killing things without too much trouble. Um, but I still get, because of their level, I still get a decent bit of equipment here. Okay. Boom. Yeah, 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 yeah. Boom. I did not have as much energy as I thought I did there. Okay. North, where do we go? I want to activate this rift at the very least. And I want to visit the island, actually. Hello. Alright. Yeah, we're in a pretty good spot right now, strength-wise. Nice. That was kind of a fail. That was good. Well, better, I want to say. Oh, holy cow, that's a lot of bugs. Um. That was fairly effective. No, you get out of here. We gonna be okay? Yeah, we're gonna be fine. Unless that's an ambush. Let's really quickly regenerate using the constitution, and then we... Food ration, and then we crack this bad boy open. Okay, ambush chance is 8%. Nice low percentage, though that's never mattered before. Okay, uh, we'll take these guys out. Nice. 
Nice good swarm of enemies right here. Hello. You wanna relax? Thanks. Nope, thank you. But I don't have time for that. Thank you. Alright. Heal up really quick. Grab some energy through natural regeneration really quick. Boom. Good. Bait it out. There we go. Nice. Take care of you. Get rid of you. Get rid of you. And then you. That was a beautifully timed level up, I must say. Alright. Alright. Nope. Nope. Good. Perfect. Oh, hello. Forgot about the third wave. Get rid of you first. Good. Ouch. Good. Oh, we have a problem. Get out of here. Thank you. Back it up. Back it up. Oh, all right. That takes care of you. Uh, I don't know where you came from, but that's a bit of a problem. Good, that takes care of you. And there we go. All right, this should be clear. It is. Go back to Devil's Crossing. I want to go to the island. I also will have enough scrap at this point to give to the guy to get to uh, the other place there. Uh, to be able to get into the slit cellar, which is about where I would normally want to go in there anyways. So that's fine. We probably won't tackle that this episode. This has been... This build slaps. Interesting. I wonder what he's playing. That's good. Oh, hello. I'm just going to go ahead and shoot you regular so I can conserve energy. If I only I could hit you. There we go. Righteous Fervor, Aegis of Men here, Paladin. Burn to physical. Okay. Fair enough. Fair enough. Yeah, these guys are roughly a good level for me to be here. I kind of push my luck a little bit by being level 11. You can see where I'm barely, like, getting regular amounts here. Okay, good. Pardon me. We don't do that here. All right. Let me crack this open really quick first. All right, we have no, we had no energy potions. All right, ambush chance is ten percent. That's fine. That's okay. That was nice. That was nice. Good. Get rid of you. Perfect. Alright, good. And then we're going to just pop over here. Ambush chance is 11%. Goody, goody, gumdrops. My ambush chance goes up far lower, it seems, if the chest is some kind of internal level lower than mine. Because this these chests are about my level, I would guess. Uh, and that's been 1% increases each time. I'm gonna bet, probably, and I don't know this necessarily off the top of my head, I, I have no idea if this is true or not, 
but it seems like I have just a baseline 5% chance to be ambushed, and then every time I open a chest, it's increased by some amount based upon what I, I believe is probably the internal level of the chest. Um, is just what I'm guessing based on how the mechanics have worked so far. You're basically worth nothing to me, but that's fine. Alright, so so far so good um, with the build so far. Uh, I'll eventually be running the full uh, Oldswin's Chosen. I'll be running Renato. I'll be running a Canister Bomb. I don't think I'm going to run Fire Strike, but I might. And then I'll be grabbing Night Blade and taking just the Phantasmal Blades all the way to uh, Nether Edge and uh, Pneumatic Burst to at least... Um, this isn't going to save because I don't have any points in but I'm going to take Pneumatic Burst and also Shadow Dance just to increase my survivability a bit more. But I'm going to take Phantasmal Blades all the way over to here. I'm not going for Frenetic Throw. I'm just going to take it all the way over to here. Uh, but for Demolition, is this going to be uh, Ulzawind's Chosen, the three effects, which would be Stun Jax, Canister Bomb, and Granado. And I want Flame Touched and Temper. Temper because obviously it's increasing Pierce Damage, which I want. Uh, flame Touch because Flame Touch actually gets a Pierce Damage bonus with the set that I intend on using, so that's going to be really nice as well. So that's why I wanted Flame Touch specifically. And again, I might go Fire Strike. If I do go Fire Strike, I'm only going to be going up to uh, Searing Might, and I wouldn't go past that. If I even get that far, I'm not really sure yet. That's going to really depend. Actually, do I really want to actually... Uh, yeah, probably it would be best, because Stun Jacks are just stupid good. But it'll depend on uh, how my skills feel at that point. But uh, that's what we're running with so far. No points so far, but that's okay. It's early early days yet. I'm not too concerned. But that's where we're going to run. Uh, so that was uh, the first uh, 45 minutes of Season 4 League. So here we go. And uh, yeah, I guess... Oh, wait, I have to return. I don't have the emulator. Never mind. Uh, I need to... That's right, I actually need to go to this list seller. We'll go down to that next episode. But thank you all very much for joining me. If you liked this, please like and subscribe. If you didn't, please ignore me. And if you have any comments, questions, concerns, ideas, suggestions, requests, please leave them down in the comment section below. And thank you all very much for joining me. And have a great 24 hours.